So tonight, a little national news at the top here. The search continues tonight for a missing submersible vehicle with five people aboarded in the North Atlantic. Now, a deep sea research technology firm with operations right here in Western New York has been brought on to help. Channel 2's Ron Plants has a look at the work being done at the Buffalo Niagara International Airport. Interestingly enough, apparently Buffalo is now part of this major rescue effort to try to rescue that trapped or missing submarine that is carrying five people in the North Atlantic in the vicinity of the wreckage of the Titanic. Uh, we have seen here at the airport, you can see one behind me that perhaps there, three large C-17 cargo planes. These are Air Force cargo planes that can carry a lot of uh, equipment. And apparently one of these cargo planes was seen lifting off this afternoon with what we're told by an airport official is apparently a remotely piloted submersible. But again, these Air Force cargo planes are flying this equipment from a company called Pelagic Research, which is actually based in East Aurora. And apparently that is where they started. Now they're also up in Massachusetts up there with an operation. I'm going to read from their website. They say Pelagic Research Services has been contacted by Ocean Gate Expeditions to provide critical support in the current rescue operation of the submersible Titan in the North Atlantic. Currently, PRS Pelagic is in the process of mobilization as quickly and as safely as possible to assist in the search and rescue effort. And then they um, obviously go a little bit more into describing how they could perhaps help in this search and rescue. We'll have more information as it becomes available, but that's the situation here from the Buffalo Niagara International Airport. I'm Ron Plants, Channel 2 News.